can see you're probably thinking, wow, that's big curly hair. Um, this is actually my um, Kerry inspired hair um, from the Kerry Diaries because that's a TV show that's going to come on very shortly and I can't wait because I actually just finished reading the first book here and I absolutely loved it. It says through like Pretty Little Liars, New Girl, um, Modern Family, Heart of Dixie. So this is like a new series for me to get obsessed with as well. A bit of a closer one. I'll zoom up on it. And basically her hair is just really big and curly. I should have done this when I had blonde hair still. But um, it's just really big and curly. But not all the curls are like really tight. Some of them are more looser than the rest of them. I don't know if you can see the top of my hair. I kind of cut it off. But my fringe is kind of gone airborne. It's just whoo my version of her hair and if you want to know how I did this I'll show you right now also if you're wondering what I'm wearing I'm just wearing like this little leotard that I got in my clown outfit um, because it was like the only bright thing that I could wear because it was kind of based on 80s so I'm trying to wear bright things but this is the only bright thing I had anyway um yeah I'll show you guys how I did this hair right now Okay, so I've already had a shower this morning and I waited for my hair to be like semi dry, semi damp and then I blow dried my hair upside down so it's really, really fluffy if you can see it's just pfft. What I'm going to do is separate my hair from ear to ear so um, we can work with the bottom section first and for this I'm going to be using a straightener and this curling wand here. So this one's the same like all the way along and it really doesn't matter if your curling wand isn't because we're just going to be using two different effects and that's why I have two. I just want to create different looks on each curl because her curls aren't all quite the same. So if you don't know how to straighten so if you don't know how to curl your hair with a straightener, I will link my video down below which tells you exactly how to get a beautiful curl using a straightener. I'm just going to curl random bits and and so I've got this nice loose curl here and then I'm just going to grab another random section from this part. different kind of curls going through your hair you don't want them all going in the same direction so just every now and again just try something different spice it up a little bit and so these are the kind of curls that my curling one give me they're a lot tighter I'm just going to take my hair out of this little messy bun I just threw it in. And so we're going to be doing the same thing to the top layer of hair.
Okay, so there you have it. I've just gone between that layer of hair again with the straightener and curl. And this actually looks very similar to hers. If you want it even bigger, you can take bits and like just grab a comb and tease them so they're a lot bigger. Just like that. Final look, it's really big. My hair is longer than hers, so it can't really stay as curly as hers because it's got more length to curl. And it's pretty similar. She's got that one bit at her fringe that's a bit looser than the rest of it. I'm not sure if you can tell, but if you have a picture or you Google, you'll notice, which I try to do here, which I just use the straightener for because I find the straightener does have looser curls than the curling ones. Big, um, and yeah, I hope everyone enjoyed this one and I can't wait till the show comes on. You can just rough it around a little bit more if you want, make it a bit bigger, make it the way you want it. And yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!